I only had one piece of paper left for my printer, and I used it to print out the outline, and apparently I forgot it in my car, so I'm just going to sit about it. Okay, um, good morning. My name is Karen Gordas, and um, I'm going to talk to you guys about a specific uh a specific part of my life that I think has shaped me into the person that I am now. Um, I think, uh, like Yvette mentioned, like I feel like some situations can either you can either take as experience or you can learn from it. Um, for me, it was the time my dad passed away. Uh, I was 12 years old, and it really just changed my outlook in life. But mostly, it was a really big change because I was born and raised in Guatemala. And I moved here when I was about 14. And so I started middle school and it was really scary because um, middle school is a really weird time of your life and everybody's just trying to figure everything out. Um, so starting off in middle school, I had no, uh, no knowledge of like English. I couldn't communicate with other people and it was really hard. And so that itself, just moving to California was a really big, um, it was a really big change in lifestyle. Um, as I came here, I started to realize that um, there's a lot of cultural differences. There's a lot of um, things that you're not exposed to in different parts of the, the world. Um, and I feel like it has really changed me because not only did my dad pass away, but I was also you know, adapting to a new um, environment. And it was... Uh, it was a really big learning experience, and I feel like as I was learning English, I became bilingual, and that, I feel, has helped me a lot, um, like finding jobs and stuff. Um, it has become a big part of me, and uh, I feel like it will still continue to, um, to affect me in the future, and the way that I see that now is because um, I'm pursuing two majors and I hope to double major in Spanish and in biology. And um, as of now, I have already uh, been working with children. I work with, uh, well I used to work up until recently. I used to work in an elementary school as a leader for a after school program. And as I got the job, I was told that there was another person competing against me, but the only reason why I was more um, suitable for the job was because I was bilingual. And a lot of the kids that stay at the program, their parents are Hispanic or they have some cultural background like that and they need translation. So I feel like that has become a really big part of my life and it was a big learning experience. Thank you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven people are missing. That's a lot. Did anybody miss the roll sheet over there? Oh, it's currently in the two extreme sides here. Enrique, welcome back. You're up. 